you can easily record all the events you conduct on ClickMeeting. Just hit the record button in the event room when you start your event. A pulsing red light will indicate that the recording is on. Please note that your event is recorded using your attendees view. So any webinar room elements that aren't supposed to be seen by them, such as moderator tools, will not be captured. You can stop the recording at any time by clicking the record button again. Whenever you close the webinar room, your recording stops automatically. All your recordings are stored in the Storage tab in your Account Panel in the Recordings sub-tab. The recordings are available shortly after your event ends, but it may take up to one hour for them to appear in your Account Panel. While in the Recordings sub-tab, you can easily play any recording by clicking its name or thumbnail. To delete any unnecessary part, click Actions beside the name of the recording and choose Edit. You can trim out parts at the beginning and end of your recording, leaving out any irrelevant portions. If you're not happy with the results of the editing, you can always restore the recording to its original form from the Actions menu. You can download the recording in the handy MP4 format or copy it to your Dropbox account. You can also publish your recordings directly on your YouTube channel you'll need to integrate your Dropbox or Google accounts with your ClickMeeting account first. Please note that the amount of storage space for recordings in your account is based on your type of account. This storage space is renewable. Simply download the recordings and delete them from your storage section and you'll recover that space. Another way to free up some space is to move your recordings to a separate archive in your account. Simply go to Actions beside the recording you want to move and click Archive. You can access your recordings stored in the archive, but you can't play, edit, or share them. To use those functions, retrieve the recording so it appears in your Recordings tab. Please note that on large files, such operation may take a while. That's it for now. See you in the next episode.